What's going on guys? New episode of Ryan on Gaming. This topic comes from Andreas Simonsen. I hope I said your name right. Hey Ryan, do a topic on why you are a PlayStation channel and why do you do PlayStation videos rather than Xbox or Nintendo? This is something I get quite often, you know, why are you a PlayStation channel? Especially since um, often, you, you know, you guys watch my videos. I, I talk a lot about not just PlayStation, but greater aspects of the industry. But then you might wonder, why is it only PlayStation reviews? Why is there only Let's Talk PlayStation? I've had people say, how about there's, you know, hit Ryan, do like a Let's Talk Xbox, Let's Talk Nintendo, all that stuff. Um, so why am I a PlayStation channel? And, you know, there's been a few times where I've been pretty vocal about this, where it was like, um, I've t done tons of videos where I'm like, I openly admit, I PlayStation is my preferred ecosystem. It's the platform I play on the most. It's where I invest a lot of my money in terms of games. I prefer consoles. That's where I play is PlayStation consoles and all that stuff. Uh, I'm all about Vita, PSP games, all that, you know, so... Right off the bat, that might tell you why this is a PlayStation channel, but um, realistically, I mean, if you want a greater, more expanded answer, it's that when I started YouTube about going on three years ago now, if not three years ago at this point, when I started this YouTube channel, I thought to myself, you know, there's lots of great channels out there that focus on just one specific platform. And they do it really, really well. Like, you know, PC, there's tons of PC gamers out there that do that have great channels, uh, PC commentary, all that stuff, um, all about the PC platform. There's a lot of tech YouTubers and stuff about building PCs and all that stuff, right? That's covered. Uh, tons of Xbox channels. People love Xbox. Um, tons of channels dedicated to Xbox. Um, Nintendo has a loyal following on YouTube. Tons of big YouTubers. Nintendo Capri Sun and all that. Uh, all these, uh, you know, Nintendo Let's Players and everything. Lots of great stuff there. There's not really a great PlayStation channel. At least that's how I felt three years ago, mind you. Um, now, there's like, you know, some people might, might bring up somebody like, uh, I don't know, White Boy 7th Street. Like, he plays, like, primarily on PlayStation. But he doesn't really talk about the games industry. He doesn't really talk about Sony specifically. Their commentaries, Call of Duty commentaries. Sometimes he will play PC games. He's not exclusively PlayStation, even though he does prefer that platform. So I thought, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make a YouTube channel cover just PlayStation, I'm, and, and I'm going to do it well. And that's what I find is really important if you're going to be doing YouTube videos, if you're going to be jumping onto the internet, and especially with games and trying to get involved in games, whether you're starting a games website or a video game related channel, um, it's such a packed, you know, mass market type sort of situation on YouTube. It's like the, it's the biggest content on YouTube. So you really got to differentiate yourself or at the very least offer something that you are, that other people aren't offering. So in which case, if you focus on one platform, you can easily cover it better. You can talk about more aspects of what that particular company is doing. If you're trying to cover every single, uh, you know, every single aspect of games, um, you're going to have a very difficult time trying to not only keep up with news, keep up with proper videos, um, proper discussion, um, but you're just going to flood your channel probably with too many videos or something like that. Um, I just feel that it's very important that if you're going to do something, uh, whether it's a YouTube channel, whether it's a job, whether it's a, uh, an art, uh, a craft, an art form, whatever you're trying to do in life, um, focus on one specific area and do it really, really, really well. You're try trying to cover too many bases is where a lot of people are going to fail. Trying too many things at once is where people are going to fail. And that's what I kind of wanted to do with this YouTube channel is cover PlayStation, which is my preferred platform. I know Sony really well. I know the developers, their publishers and everything. Um, I mean, publishers within the industry, you know, I, I know the games industry well and everything. I felt pretty confident starting this channel and going directly into it with PlayStation stuff. And, you know, for me at least, it's it's good that I did start a PlayStation-only channel because I ended up, I, I did end up finding my audience. I did end up building a channel. Now I have consistent viewers, you guys that uh, consistently watch and everything. And now it's gotten to the point where people do like my content, but they get to the point where they're saying, hey, well, why don't you do Let's Talk Xbox or Let's Talk Nintendo? I want to see uh, more stuff from you. And I really appreciate that. But at this point, I've made such a commitment to doing PlayStation only, I feel like that's kind of like what I owe to you guys in a sense, right? Like, you know, for the past three years now, every single one, at the end of every one of my videos, I tell you guys to subscribe for more PlayStation stuff. I've had a banner up for like three years that says, you know, subscribe for PlayStation news, reviews, let's plays, all that stuff, right? I've been tell like telling anybody that visits my channel, this is a channel where you're going to get like awesome PlayStation coverage and so that's what I feel I should keep doing. And, be, and and not only that, but that's because that's why people have initially subscribed, right? They didn't subscribe thinking, okay, someday he's going to expand. Well, yeah, they do think that, but not necessarily to the point where I completely changed the goal of my channel and what I wanted to do with my channel. And that's kind of why, you know, some people, when they do get like really, really big, 100,000 plus subscribers or something, they'll open up like 17 other channels that's like, oh, here's my gaming channel. Here's my vlog channel. Here's my I'm sitting on the toilet shitting channel. So... 
that's not entirely out of the realms of possibility for, you know, me possibly if I ever decide to do something like that. I don't see that happening anytime soon, especially since this channel is only at like um, 50,000 subscribers. Not to say that's a bad thing, trust me, I love the fact that I've actually made it this far on YouTube. It's kind of shocking to be honest. Um, but I'm certainly pleasantly, I'm pleasantly happy with it for like, for sure. Like I am, it still blows my mind. But Andreas, I hope that answers your question. That is why I only do PlayStation stuff. That's why I don't really talk much about Nintendo or Xbox or at the very least when it's, you know, when it's, when it's appropriate, I do talk about those platforms. I, you know, uh, there's been Ryan on gaming topics, you know, kind of talking about Nintendo's history in a, in a little bit. Um, if it's kind of relevant to the, the conversation as a whole, uh, LTPS all the time, we might talk about Microsoft because so that's it's been Sony's closest competitor for a long time. Uh, we'll often talk about PC stuff when it's ever compared in terms of different industries, you know, when it comes to PC gaming versus console and how those two things kind of coexist and how you know, PC gaming is on the rise and everything. We do kind of cover a little bit of our basis here outside of the world of PlayStation. And I think that's the good thing about this video series, Ryan on Gaming, which is it's Ryan on Gaming, not Ryan on PlayStation. So people can ask me um, grander topics on the gaming industry and I'll, you know, no matter what it is, I will give you my answer to it. So. I hope that answers your question. Anyway, that about does it for this topic of Ryan on Gaming. If you have something that I want to be on, not yourself, calm down. <laughs> I don't swing that way, buddy. <laughs> you gotta pay. If you want me to be on a gaming topic that you want to submit to me, then go right ahead, submit it in the comments below, and I will probably do that topic if it's a really good topic, because that's what I do here topics not you guys no i'm not gonna do you guys i'm gonna do the topics and that's what's important i, I want to make it very clear we you and me are a friend friend basis i don't want to say that i'm putting you in the friend zone but i kind of am